Welcome back everyone. Today I'm playing Moth House. I actually really like moths, so this might not scare me too much, but let's find out. A letter? Dear son, I hope this letter finds you well. I'm writing to inform you that I'm leaving for far from here on an expedition. Unfortunately, I can't provide a location. I know this may come as a surprise to you. But please understand that this decision was not an easy one. If in a year you do not receive a letter from me, it means that I will not return. I hope that this will not happen, but if I still do not get in touch, then I have a request to you. In the attached letter, there is a list with species of moths. Come to my house and catch at least one of each species, and then let them out of the house. But it's better if you free them all. With all my love, your dad. Oh. Oh, okay. I like this. I like the aesthetic. Very cool. Well, Dad, I'm doing all your dirty work for you yet again. What the hell? Not cool. All right, where's this moth that you speak of? I really dig this. Is that a rat or a moth? Control to crouch, you got it. Oh, there's a moth right there, and there's a ton of them over here. That's great. It looks like this, this match is almost done completely. Will it light a new one? Use the mouse wheel to change the item. There we go. And is that a waffle? I ate a waffle. Okay, it... Gotcha. What is that supposed to be? What kind of cereal is that? Lose. That's what it looks like. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, would you look at this? That's kind of beautiful. Use tab to open backpack. Oh, so it shows me which ones I've collected. All right, do I just collect as many as I can find? Well, luckily these things are everywhere, so I'm gonna have no trouble catching them. Shit, do they keep appearing though? Cause that's, <laughs> that's kind of annoying. I don't like that. I want it to be totally clean. But wait, then there was, there was more over here, right? I'm getting all of you, I think. Never thought I would do this in an indie horror game. I don't know that it's actually possible to gather every single moth. Actually, I think it is. So I don't see any more. I think I totally cleaned that area out. Okay, let's go back over here then. Oh, think you can hide from me? Stupid fool. Brainless monster. Kind of mean. Thank you. What is this? Pick off. What is that supposed to mean? What is this? Moths emit ultrasound as a way of communicating with other moths and detecting their environment. This ultrasound is typically measured in kilohertz, with the average value around 30 to 60. The moth produces the ultrasound by vibrating special organs in its body called timbles. Interestingly, there are devices called bat detectors that can capture these ultrasounds, which can help in monitoring moth populations and their behavior. This is because bats, which are natural predators of moths, also use ultrasound to locate their prey. Okay, all right, all right, I'm into it, I'm into it. Why are there two always Psych. locked? That's great. I'm going down the other one. This is the only way that I can go. Open? Yeah! Oh. Oh my god! Jeez Louise! <gasps> the goose! Oh, I love this game. Okay, give me all these moths. These things are ridiculously big, dude. That's where I start having a problem. Like this, dude? That guy's actually very chill. Adding to my collection. I'm just gonna keep gathering all these moths. It said there were three endings, though. I don't foresee me getting any ending by not gathering everything. There are so many of these things, and the little tiny baby ones are really hard to see. But I think I cleared it. I hope I cleared it. Did I clear it, Goose? I think that's a yes. So I'm gonna go with yes. Look at that. I'm hearing a lot of moth activity behind there. Oh, and there's a bunch over here. I'm trying to eat some cereal. And what is this that I'm looking at? That's a cereal called That's what I'm calling it. Delicious, part of a balanced breakfast. Along with the moths crawling around in it. And I think that's it. It's so hard to tell. Because some of these moths are like super duper small. Crowbar? Don't mind if I do. Seems to me... Oh! Cook? No recipes. 
there's yeah. cooking in this game? Well, there is also an open door over here. So I'm going to maybe try. That's open. Bunch of mods in here. These ones look a little gross, dude. I kind of feel bad, though. I think... I think they were just trying to use the facilities here. Oh, don't like them on the ceiling, dude. Have I cleared? Not sure about that sound. I think I might've gotten everything here though. So you know what? Ah, that's gonna have to not happen anymore. <laughs> Gotta be honest, I need a key for that. Okay, so there's only one place for me to go then. And I believe it's the source of a lot of this sound. See, even the goose agrees. Oh, there's another note. The Luna Moth is a large, beautiful moth native to North America. It is named after the Roman goddess of the moon because of its pale green color and crescent-shaped markings on its wings. The Luna Moth is primarily active at night. Uh-oh, okay, well, I can kind of relate there i'm not gonna lie i'm very active at night where's this crowbar is this it oh okay open oh my god i see a lot of them over there don't want to explain what i thought that was it's not very family friendly f to light or put out a match okay i can do it manually cool no what if i just stood in the middle of this It doesn't hurt, that's for sure. See, these moths just want pizza, dude. That's all they want. They're chilling. Gather them all. Before they take my slice. Is that it? Did I do it? I think I got rid of all of them. What about over here? Oh my god. This place is too big, dude. Save recipe. What is that all about? Okay. You know what? We're gonna hold off on going down there for the time being. I'm gonna go find some more moths. For real though, this place is massive. How am I supposed to get all the moths in here? Out of here? It makes no sense. It's gonna take forever, dude. There's another note though. The Death's Head Hawk Moth is a large and distinctive moth that is found in various parts of the world, including Europe, Asia, and Africa. It gets its name from the skull-shaped pattern on its thorax, which resembles a human skull and has long been associated with death and the supernatural. Okay, so where, what next? Why is there so much to explore here? It seems like it's, it wants me to fail. It wants me to not capture every single moth. But I'm kind of setting out to do that right now. Oh, look at this one. And another recipe. I still don't understand what that's all about. Kind of weird that I can cook in this game, but it's looking like I'm all clear over here. Okay, let me check this. Oh my god! I don't have the black witch, the white witch, the applebee's torful moth, and the walnut sphinx. But I have pretty much everything else. Applebee's. <laughs> what is my problem? Get over here! Come on, stop flying around and just get in my net. Never-ending moth simulator, dude. I'm about ready to be done with this. I've been catching moths all my life. Why does this open up to so many rooms, dude? It's too much. It's too much for me to keep track of. It really feels like it's never-ending moths, dude. It's kind of getting on my nerves. The completionist in me is really not happy right now because I know I have way too much to do. Another recipe. Okay. What am I to cook? I'm hungry, so I kind of want to cook soon. Oh! Oh. Okay. I think I know where the big moth sound is coming from. It's coming from the big moth. Oh, oh. Is it coming over here? Do I have to be worried? Is it going to kill me? I have no personal vendetta against you, moths. I'm just doing what I've been assigned to do by my father. I need to get this done quick because I think I'm in the path of the giant moth. And that, that is a sentence I don't think I would ever say. When I woke up today, I didn't think I would say that. Come on. Come on. How many of these stupid thi things are there? Oh, 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 God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Please leave me alone. Please leave me alone. I didn't think I would be this afraid. This has all of a sudden become intense and frightening. Where the hell? Come on, dude. 
Come on, get in my net. Get in my freaking net. Oh my god. One more? Oh, dude, come on. Come on! I'm never gonna catch this stupid moth. I'm never gonna catch this stupid thing. Did I catch it? Is never over? Okay. 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 I'm being hunted! I'm being actively hunted by a giant moth! This is not cool. This is not cool. This is not cool. What happens if it fucking catches me? Oh god. It's a dead end. It's a dead end. What is this? Mason Hart, well-known moth collector, discovered a moth that can talk? Lingua moth? Why? Why? Why are you doing this to me? Why are you doing this to me? How do I get... I can't catch that moth. I think it's about time I go to the basement. Oh, he can come downstairs? Oh, God. Oh, God. I am so unbelievably nervous because of this, dude. I don't want to... I've done so much already. I've collected so many moths. I don't want to lose. I don't want to have to restart and do all of this all over again. I'm on a personal mission to free every moth in this house. He better not come downstairs, dude. He's coming the fuck downstairs. He's coming downstairs. I'm trapped. Oh, I'm trapped. Oh my God, dude, this is so nerve wracking. What am I at? What am I at? I'm still missing the white witch moth. Is that the one that's flying around trying to kill me? Goodbye. Goodbye. Nice to meet you. Last one here. Pretty sure that's it. I'm dead. I'm dead. Goaltending. Yeah. Well, I don't know what to do now. I'm trapped here forever. There's a, a human-sized moth fluttering about in front of me, <laughs> right at my path. How do I, how do I, how do I do this, dude? How do I get out of this scenario? I think I'm about dead here. There are no other moths to collect. Ah! Ah! Nice. Oh. Oh. Am I still supposed to be collecting these? It's letting me. Okay, so it just cocooned me. This game managed to put the fear of God in me. The fear of moth in me. I never had that fear before. But that was terrifying. I, that was like a big YouTuber jump scare moment right there. <laughs> Actually got me. So, but how did this happen? Is this because of the lingua moth? Are there more moths that are like sentient and able to understand the human language? I think this is meant for me not to collect every single one. I think I'm just doing this out of a, the thought that maybe an ending is getting every single moth. But I don't know that that's actually the case. Have I finally... No, I still haven't collected the white witch moth. So I don't even know where that is. Should I even bother doing what I'm doing right now? Okay, you know something? I think I've had about enough. I think I'm done, dude. I think I'm done collecting all these moths in here. Y'all can chill. I'm gonna go upstairs. I do have to say though, it's pretty remarkable how all these different independently moving moths are able to exist in this game at the same time. It's kind of very impressive. For a little indie horror game, this there's a lot of detail to this. So if there's anything I could say to the developer, it's good work on that. And quite honestly, that's all I'm gonna bother with. The rest of it, no thank you. Open. Where does this lead? Is that thing still roaming around? It leads right to the entrance. Oh, okay. Oh, you know something? I can also go to the kitchen. Let me see what I can do with those recipes. So it looks like I can cook this one. Take? Why? What is that for? Is this to get all the endings? So maybe then. I should just try to collect even more. Maybe that's what it is. Because there are three recipes. Oh my god, oh my god. I'm gonna keep it moving. Do I have the... No, I still don't have the white witch moth. 
What is going on? Chill. Another recipe. So maybe that isn't the endings then. What do those recipes do? I don't have the foggiest idea what to do in this game, dude. I've been playing this for half an hour right now. Still no sign of the White Witch Moth, and I'm starting to think that maybe that big one that's floating around is the White Witch Moth. I'm out of here, dude. I'm out of here. I'm in a bedroom now for reasons I do not understand. Hi, Paul. Turns out Lingua Moths has many abilities besides speaking human language. They are capable of... <laughs> I grow new types of moths in the basement. I hope that while I'm away, the house will not rot from a large number of different moths. Just in case, I'll block the entrance if something happens. I left the key in the attic library. Thank you for going away. I appreciate that, Mr. Moth. Now, how do I get to the attic library? Oh, oh. Here's the library. Are you white witch moths? Yes! Oh my god! I got them! I got them all! Give me that, give me that. No, 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 no. Oh no. Okay, just go. What is this? Mason Hart. Nobel Prize. Lingua Moth. Okay, I don't care about your Nobel Prize, Dad, if that's really who you are. Are you really my father? What is happening? Okay, I can't be in here. I'm out of here, dude. I'm going. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. I have all the moths. I have every single type of moth. Okay, okay. I'm out, dude. I'm out. I'm in. I'm in. I'm staying in. I'm staying in. Oh, God, I'm staying in. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like this, dude. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, oh. I'm going to get caught. I'm going to get caught by this giant moth. It's not leaving me alone, dude. Look at it! It's gone. Okay, you know something? Why don't I just gather? Why don't I gather? A few more. Just a few more. I'm addicted to collecting moths. I'm out of here, dude. I don't even know where this goes. This key? It's the basement again? Maybe down here? Another recipe. Give us this way. Okay, okay. Can I go? Can I leave? Perhaps? Is that what it said? that the entrance was blocked and that I have to use. Okay, I left. Uh. I'm letting them out. Okay. Is that an ending? I guess so. Wow. That was kind of intense. Well, I'm hopping back in because there's two other endings. I want to see if maybe I can try to get it. Hello, little rat. But don't worry, I won't bore you guys with the details. I'm going to just gather and get to the end. Okay, I ended up getting the key and it said this needed a key. Open. Earthquake? I can't move. I can't move. Uh. Talk? Hello, human. I'm the Moth King's helper. You see, the king can't speak like a human, unlike me. I know the human language, and I can also translate from the language of moths. Our master has disappeared from this house, and the Moth King is hungry. He is already tired of eating little moths flying by past him. Once he even almost ate me. The king needs to be fed urgently and with normal food. He needs soup. Moth soup. There are many types of moths, and if you mix them properly, you'll make a great soup. Please make a soup and feed the Moth King. Okay, so then maybe there's a recipe that requires every moth. Uh, I don't know how I would find it, unless I have already. I have. Not enough ingredients, okay. So then I'm gonna try and get, I, I think maybe I might have to get caught. Either that or I can go down into the basement. 
to try to find more mothitude. This has become a very bizarre experience. It's also taking a very long time to play this game, I'm not gonna lie. Like, incredibly long. I found another recipe. What are these? Are these the ones that I need? Maybe? I got three black witch moths. Yeah, I got the Applebee's one too. Okay, let me grab as many of these as I can. Nice, okay. So not bad. Now I can just go straight back. Let's cook this up. I'm ready. Take it and feed it to the giant moth mouth over here. Well, buddy, I hope you're hungry. Thanks, but one pot of soup isn't enough for a king. Make more soup. Okay. Also, I don't know if the king liked this soup. So it's better will be if you make soup from other ingredients. What? Okay, so I'm gonna try this then. I just did a random one. What is happening? How do I make this work? B? King has not eaten for a long time and two pots of soup is not enough. Make another batch. I think I'll have enough. Okay, put that on here. Cook something up. This? Perhaps? I don't know. I'm doing whatever at this point. Eat it. Thank you so much for feeding the Moth King. He really liked your soups. So he has powers and we can finally leave this old house and find yourself another place where there is normal food. I was glad to meet you, but we have to go. Goodbye. Another ending. And what is... Okay, there we go. Wow. But then how would I get the final ending. Okay, so I ended up looking up Don Eleven Landry's video to figure out how to get the other ending, and I think I just have to make, like, bad soups for the, the Moth King, whatever the hell his name was, and I think that just requires me not, possibly not feeding him the one that takes one of each moth. So I'm gonna do my thing here again. I'm just gonna go grab a bunch of different ones and try to find a basic recipe and see if maybe that'll be enough to get the next ending. Okay, I have the key, I have the soup. I really hope this works, man. I spent a lot of time just collecting moths. All right, so you're gonna have this. Thanks, but one pot of soup isn't enough for a king. Make more soup. Also, I don't know if the king liked this soup, so it's better will be if you make soup from other ingredients. Okay, well, you know something? I'm gonna just make the same exact recipe because I, I think that's how I do this. I think I have to make the king angry. And here you go. Thank you, but the king has not eaten for a long time in two pots of soup. So make another batch. I think he'll have enough. So I'm confused then. Is there a particular soup that he doesn't want? I'm assuming having this in the mix is, is necessary. Let me try doing the same one. Hopefully this will trigger the next ending. I hope I don't get the same one. However, he says that your soups were terrible. Come on, man. I really tried. He would have been better off starving. That's that's really harsh. I don't want to do this, but I have to follow the king's orders. The Moth King says you killed moths for nothing to make those awful soups. He wants to drive you to Moth Hell. Moth Hell is a terrible place for moths, but not only moths can get there, but people too. For example, our owner got there. My dad? Okay then, on this we will have to part. I'm sorry, but there's no choice. So goodbye. What are you doing? I'm in Moth Hell. This is Moth Hell, the lamps. Oh my God, dude. What a goofy ending. Am I a moth? I'm a moth. And there we go. All endings. Well, I gotta say that wasn't bad. That took me a very long time though. That took me like an hour to play and I don't think it should have. I think I wasted a lot of time on my first run collecting moths for no reason. I was under the impression that I had to gather literally every moth that existed in that house to let them out, but I guess only one of each was necessary, unless there's a secret ending 
but it's gonna take me like another two hours to get every single moth in that house. So yeah, I think that's gonna wrap it up for me here. I really enjoyed this. I love the style of it, especially like the superimposed hand with the items. I thought that was a really cool addition. And I didn't expect a game about moths to actually scare me. This got me really good at a couple points, so yeah good work dev but yeah as of now that's gonna wrap it up here if you guys want to try this out for yourselves be sure to check the link down below in the description as usual and yeah thanks again everyone for being here and showing me the support you show me on this channel every single day you all mean the world to me if you happen to enjoy this video be sure to hit that like button down below leave me a little comment let me know how you feel and if you're new to the channel and you like what i'm doing here please consider subscribing it really helps me out a lot once again i thank you all so much for watching this video and i can't wait to see you all in the next one take it easy